everyone, Edgy Berserker back with Street Fighter 2 Turbo. Super Street Fighter 2 Turbo, if you want to get really technical. <laughs> Just getting ahead on the videos. Last we saw was E Honda, and now we're on to Avalanca. Okay, um, I wish I could make him green, but I don't think there's any way I could get default colors in this game. That's okay, though. That's fine. I can deal with that. <laughs> Blanca, another character I am Garbo with. That's perfect. Because I saw, though, that next episode is going to be a character I am not Garbo with. And I'm excited for that one. <laughs> I forgot to change the option again for the uh, punches and the kicks and the strong kick. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Guess so much for being Garbo. <laughs> I still am. I still am. This is only the first fight. And then it gets harder, you know, as it goes by, so yeah. Ah, fuck. Fucking Sandy suplex bullshit. There we go. I keep that up. Oh. <laughs> Apparently, Zangi foot go through. Electro shield. Or something. I like that. I, I call that his strong hit there, where he moves his hands up like that. Basically, the fuck you punch. He looks like he's giving you the double bird. <laughs> At least it's not movie, Blanca. <laughs> that was so stupid. I mean, granted though, I actually really love the Street Fighter movie <laughs> quite a bit. <laughs> I, I, it was just stupid how they did the Blanca thing. <laughs> it was really dumb. <laughs> but that's okay, that's okay. It's been years now, there's no point getting angry at the movie. <laughs> if anything, it's good fun now. I liked it. <laughs> Alrighty, so now we got Mr. Edmund Honda himself. Wait, is his name Edmund? I don't know, I always thought he, uh, Eve Honda stand for Edmund Honda. <laughs> Honda. <laughs> I could be wrong though. Yeah, eat my electricalness. Oh god, I'm so bad with Blanca. Oh, okay, that's another move. Come on, Blanca. Yeah! Do your Kano roll. <laughs> Oh my god, it's nice to be ahead on everything right now, my recording. It's great. I'm not overworking myself, in fact, I'm just waiting. Uh, because I'm gonna be having dinner with a friend, and, um, they're not gonna be available till 5 o'clock. And, while well, recording, um, I still have, like, three hours, so... Really, I might as well just do some recording and get her done. <laughs> Which is great for me because uh, that gives me time to concentrate on stuff, get ahead, keep a nice schedule going in case something comes up. And that's the thing, like that's something I never really got myself in the pace of until recently. Japan. Because I've been trying to schedule myself to just work on shit, you know? It's great. It's really, it's really great when you're actually organized for once in your goddamn life. <laughs> Oh, man, speaking of organization, though, um, my mess of the uh, DVD Blu-ray shelf is going to be organized on a Friday. Because I have it off since it's Good Friday. It's stat holiday. So I don't have to work, but I get paid for it, which is great. <laughs> and uh, I figured, you know what, I'm going to use it time to organize my game shelves, which isn't too much organization, which is great. And my uh, movie shelves, so I'm going to just take my time to do that. And go from there, really. Uh, I'm, I'm just, mm, I'm not sure how I'm gonna organize the movies, so that's the thing. I just know one shelf I'm gonna put all the anime on. That way it's just easier to find. Um, if there's room on that shelf, though, which there will be, I'm gonna probably put my Mystery Science Theaters and Incognito Cinema Warrior DVDs on there as well. And then the other stuff is just movies that I'm just going to try to organize in some way. <laughs> I don't think I'll do alphabetical order. That would be a little bit of overkill. But I'm going to do something where it's at least, you know, I won't have to look at the shelf and go, fuck, I have to look for something there. <laughs> I don't know, one shelf I just might make it all like the box sets and then the other one like just the single movies. Finally figure out what the hell I own. <laughs> Maybe someday I might actually do like a little like vlog or something about like, you know, watch a movie and talk about it because I have so many of them. Might as well make myself motivated to do something about it. 
I don't know. We'll see, though. I might just... Uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll make that a Patreon goal. Because <laughs> we still have the Tekken one going. And maybe, you know, if I hit a certain amount, maybe I might actually start doing movie vlogs or something. Maybe. Or just make it a Patreon-only thing or something. I don't know. We'll figure it out. <laughs> Just because uh, I'm, I am very camera shy. So uh, that said, <laughs> that that would be like an undertaking itself for me to do that. Oh, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> do I really want to be seen on camera? Not really. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> Seeing you in action is a joke. <laughs> Blanca looks so intimidating in that. Like, uh, screen, like that, uh, portrait. Look at him! He looks like a monster that can eat your face. <laughs> and now you know he's a big softy. Oh, Guile and him got the same color scheme. I'm so happy for them. <laughs> Street Fighter Collection! I don't know. This isn't a bad port, in my opinion. Feels nice. I remember the PC one being pretty solid, though. Except for the shitty cover art, but I don't want to get into that. <laughs> this bad cover art. <laughs> I'm gonna find that disc again, because though, because the OST sound, the AST soundtrack, the arranged soundtrack, really impressive on that one though. I I liked it a lot. Oh yeah, that works great for the sonic booms. Holy shit. I figured out counter stuff with Blanca, guys. I'm so excited. You got me go being all Blanca, like. Oh my god. So great. Yeah, fuck you. Sonic boom that one, asshole. Ugh. Edgy wins. I am still drinking my ginger lime, by the way. I rec I'm recording this after my uh, Dirge of Cerberus uh, playthrough. So, I, yes, I still don't have a headache, and it's great. Because <laughs> uh, when I first started recording, which was would be my Tekken episode, I had, like, a nasty headache. And then, <laughs> then on Dirge of Cerberus, I'm just like, ugh, so I had to take a break. And then I continued recording again, and I sound more lively, and it's pretty obvious that I'm feeling better. Cause I, I'm being more talkative. I was given the silent treatment for a bit just because of how like uh, headachy I was. It was just, ugh. It was miserable. Ah. <laughs> uh. Oh god. Yeah. <laughs> it's strange though, because one thing I want to do with like my Patreon dollars, not just for like you know having some, like, extra money or whatever just to be able to produce this stuff. But also to support other channels, too. <laughs> I know, it sounds weird and noble in a way, but eh. But I know others are paying me to do stuff, too. But, yeah, like, I, just, I don't know. I just want to help out other people, too. Like, believe me, if my Patreon gets up higher, I'd probably be throwing more money at Incognito Cinema Wars for sure. Oh, my God! <laughs> Just enough of a sliver. That was awesome. Holy shit. Oh my god. Go Blanca. That was great. <laughs> yeah, one cool thing though was um, I, I made my sister watch a little more of JoJo's, but it's maybe JoJo's part two. And uh, her first thing was when she started, because we're at the episode where the uh, Pillar Men awaken. Not just Santana, but like Cars, Wham, and uh... ACDC, and um, her first thing is, so why are they half naked? And I, all I said was, eh, you get used to it. And then when they awoken, though, I, w I actually made the comment of, oh my god, there are my beautiful boys. <laughs> I fucking love the Pillar Men. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I think they're fucking great. <laughs> oh, I love the Pillar Men so much, oh my god. <laughs> Cars is awesome. <laughs> He saved a puppy. <laughs> that's, that's the only reason why I like cars. No, I just fucking love the Pillarman and just the whole uh, battle uh, tenacity storyline. I don't know, I think it's great. <laughs> I know a lot of people are like, oh, you can skip number one and number two and just go into Stardust. I was like, mm, watch the other stuff. It's because it doesn't have the stand thing doesn't mean you have to, like, ignore it. 
cool. Like, oh, it's just so good. I like it. I just fucking love JoJo's, man. <laughs> I know, I'm gonna keep talking about JoJo's till the cows come home. And believe me, I will feature JoJo's on this channel. Do not get me wrong. It's just, I'm waiting for a certain game before I do that, though. <laughs> Once that I get that one, then you know what? We can do some JoJo's, but until then, there won't be any JoJo's yet. Because, um, you know, I, again, I am a strong believer in you shouldn't skip part one and two just to get to Stardust Crusaders. Oh god, come on. Team Hockey, cheat, motherfucker. Oh my god! <laughs> Speaking of JoJo's. I just yelled out a Joseph Joestarism. God, Joseph Joestar is such an idiot. I love him. <laughs> best Joestar. <laughs> Not really the best, as in, oh, what a nice guy. Because, no, he's an asshole. <laughs> what an asshole. I like him. Okay. Well, I'll just cut to when uh, I have a roundup against what is what's his nuts. T-Hawk gives me so many problems, man. Okay, so I went around. That's good. Turns out being human projectile is the best option. Ooh. That's what I mean about being human projectile. Ah, fuck it, t -Hawk. Ah, What a cheap bitch. I hate him. Look at this cheap motherfucker. Oh my god. Oh, I know your every move. So I'm gonna just do and read your inputs. So I'm an asshole. Fucker. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. So that first attack. Yeah, fuck you, t -Hawk. Bitch. Yeah, gotcha. Yeah, eat it. Eat it again. Eat it some more! Mmm, feel the berserker. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm excited. I'm getting Thai food today. <laughs> I I haven't had Thai in a while, and there's a really good Viet Thai restaurant in the city. And, yeah, I just, oh. It's a hot day, though, so I don't know if I was, I was originally just going to get the uh, pho soup, but I'm like, ah, it's hot and humid. <laughs> I don't know if I want to do that. <laughs> I don't know, I'll figure it out. I just know I'm getting a fancy drink with it. <laughs> God, I love it. Ah, oh, it's so good. I just like, I am one of those people that I would try like different types of cuisine unless it was loaded with almonds. <laughs> because, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I like the uh, philosophy of uh, the guy who does bizarre foods. Uh, basically, if it looks good, eat it. <laughs> and also, if you see something, even if you think, ooh, gross, just give it a shot, you know? Just try it. And if you don't like it the first bite, try another one just in case. And yeah, I'm just like, uh, I, I've been kind of like just doing that philosophy, because if something sounds weird, maybe it's not that weird, you know? North America does have some really, really <laughs> close-mindedness about certain stuff, you know? I, I like foods and shit, because it's like, uh, what was it? <laughs> Stupid uh, thing that I saw, Entertainment Weekly was like, uh, did a thing about, like, uh, Angelia Jolie and how she uh, eats bugs, because, uh, you know, that's a part of, like, a lot of her adopted kids' uh, culture. And their thing was, oh, I guess we scored one for Team Brad because she eats bugs. And it's like, you know what, man? Don't knock her for it. She's actually, like, uh, making sure, like, her kids know about their, like, cultures and shit from the countries that they're from. And bug eating's part of it, then cool, you know? I mean, North America is kind of a bit of a stickler. And I'm not gonna lie, I am willing to try deep fried scorpion dipped in hot sauce like they do in Vietnam because that looks fucking delicious. <laughs> I'm gonna say it. I, I said it. I said it. <laughs> I am willing to try deep fried scorpion. <laughs> I'm not willing to try anything that has an almond flavor though because fuck that. Um, <laughs> fuck that. Because I hate almonds. I hate almonds so much. <laughs> it, I, it is not allergies or anything. I just hate the taste of it to the point that it actually makes me gag. <laughs> 
Any other nut, like, uh, you know, Brazil nuts or cashews or whatever, peanuts, that's fine. I like those. I love walnuts. But, no, no, almonds can go straight to hell. They're, like, those are the reasons why California is going, like, drought, you know, getting a drought. They require a lot of water. So, you know what? Almonds are assholes. And I'm gonna just stick to that. See, I'm being ethical. That's why I'm not eating fucking almonds. Fuck those things. <laughs> <laughs> That's my excuse. What's yours? <laughs> ah, 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 no, no, stop, stop. <laughs> Sound a little breathy there. What the hell? <laughs> no, Balrog, please. You won't let me be a human projectile because you are becoming a human projectile. When I get to you, I will make you the human projectile you deserve to be, sir. Until then, I am the human projectile. I am Blanca. Yeah, get through that, asshole. You know what? I dare you. Come on. Ugh. Oh, <laughs> shit. You can go past my barrier. <laughs> my barrier, no. Come on, Blanca, man. You gotta do it, BB. Come on. You can do it, BB. Chip damage. Yeah! <laughs> you win. Yeah, you bounce, BB. Do it. Bounce. <laughs> Oh, okay, we're, we're good on track. We have Vega, Sagat, and M. Bison to deal with. See you in action is a joke! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Vega time. Alright. Again, I will still stick to the fact that I like lean muscle Vega better than buff plastic Mega Man. Well, not Mega Man, but <laughs> of, like buff plastic Vega. <laughs> Certain characters it works with, but others it's like, why? Why did you choose that design? <laughs> it's just the way I am, I guess. I don't know. Like I said, he's vain. He's supposed to be more like about like his face and his beauty, not about his muscles. This is like the narcissist. <laughs> oh, is that double KO? Holy shit! <laughs> I, and, oh, this one, they don't even, that's right, they don't even give you, like, a chance to try to fucking big it. Fuck off. <laughs> Fuck off, you jump around you man. <laughs> jump around man. That's it, you're the new jump man. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Damn these charge characters. <laughs> Chip damage. Come on. Oh my god, is this another double KO? No! <laughs> yeah! Okay, one more round to go. Man, this is getting really close. Oh my god, <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> okay, here we go. We got the Blanca Groove. Yeah! I know that's shitty for me to play Blanca like that, but again, he's not my best character. I'm not gonna show off any fanciness. Come on. <laughs> what do you take me for? You know what? If I can cheap out, you know I will. I guess the computer, though, not other people. I would ne I would try my best to not do, like, a fucking Goldberg-Lesnar fight on it. <laughs> I don't do that to real people. Only the CPU. <laughs> Oh, sounds like another storm's rolling in. Holy shit, that's a lot of rain. <laughs> um, give me one moment, I'll be right back. I need to shut a window. <laughs> okay, so I'm back. Um, that was weird. It was like a huge gust of wind came through. Nothing got uh, fucking blacked out or anything. I did like put things in parts. Just in case. <laughs> that way I didn't lose my recording and I could have the first part and then go all the way back up to Sagat if I needed to. Ugh. But yeah, like, fuck. It was weird because it was like, big gust of wind came in. And you just hear like, oh, shh. And then all the sideways rain came flying through as well. I was like, oh, I better shut that window. <laughs> I have all the windows shut right now so I don't have to worry about water getting in. 
Um, things got sunny again, though, which is really fucking weird, so I think it just completely bypassed me. So, uh, yeah, if I hear about any tornadoes hitting other spots of the city, I'll know. <laughs> Jesus, that's brutal. <laughs> Ugh. Oh, my poor brother. <laughs> he was hoping that I'd work uh, later or something, like earlier, finish earlier, I should say, tomorrow. Uh, because uh, he just needed to go to the Greek bakery to get some stuff, but he needed me there to show him where it is. Aw, uh, I feel bad for him. <laughs> Anyways, I defeated Sagat. That was fun. Fuck you, Sagat. Tiger, up your butt. <laughs> Seeing you in action as a joke. Don't give me that look, sir. Oh god, he's gonna eat me. <laughs> I need to turn on a fan though if I'm gonna have the windows shut because Jesus, it's hot in here. My apartment always gets hot and stuffy. It's Violet. awful. You heard me complain about it last year too in the summer. <laughs> like so hot. <laughs> oh, the humidity on my hair. Actually, my hair is pretty poofy right now. <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. Round. April showers bring May flowers and fucking disasters. Jesus. <laughs> no, fuck you, I'm bison. I'm having a rough day here. Sir. 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 Oh my god, this music's just so nostalgic for me. Like, I know I keep talking about the damn music or whatever, but for me it's just so nostalgic because I played this game so much. Like, I mean, like, you know, Street Fighter 2 and then Super Street Fighter 2, like, you know what I mean, though, well, because there's so many alliterations of this fucking game. <laughs> but everything about it's just so nostalgic. And I do miss the themes of, like, these times, because, like, they're just catchy. And they, it's like, you know, this is the character. <laughs> like, fucking Guile's theme goes with everything, which is true. It really does. Ah, oh god, Bison's gonna kick my ass. Yeah, no, it's just got suddenly sunny, wind stopped, everything's happy. Ugh, that's kind of spooky. <laughs> oh well, I'll cut up to when I get to Bison again. You know what I mean. Get lost, you can't compare to my powers! Yeah. Sorry, I didn't show the start of this part of the match here, but my friend texted me and I hit pause for a while. <laughs> so it actually kind of worked out. <laughs> No. Whoa! Block a baby! Block a baby! You gotta do it! You gotta win! From Brazil! And your mama! Oh, you bitch! <laughs> okay, next round. Next round! Fight! Yeah, fuck you, I'm fighting. Rolling, rolling, rolling! Rolling, rolling, rolling. Oh god. Nice and why? Nice and why? Why you gotta be so good, baby? Oh my god, that looks an awesome with a hit. Ah! Fuck! Oh, eat it, Bison. Fucking eat it. I am the uh, pleasing color palette, Bianca. You will eat. Oh god, I'm gonna get some hard suddenly. Okay, you know what? I gotta cheese him out like I usually do. Ugh, it's hard though, because Blanca's kicks have different range! Oh, come on. Cheese him out, Blanca. You can do a BB, come on. Ah! Eat it, Bison. God, just fucking eat it, please. Oh god. Ugh. No! 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 It's okay. I still got a round. <laughs> Edgy's pouting. <laughs> you can do it. Put your ass into it. Uh, I can do it. Put your ass into it. Oh god, I'm gonna lose again. Cheese strategy, that's why. Oh my god. You know what? Uh, Well, that first round, and then once I get to the second round, I always mess up. <sighs> okay, let's try this again. Oh, yeah. Come on, eat it, bison. Eat it. Come on, you stink bitch. Eat it. That's right, you stink bitch. Eat it. Eat it so hard. Come on. 
Come on, eat my fist. No! <laughs> He's doing so well. I was cheesing him up, guys. Yeah! Edgy wins, finally. <laughs> Blanca looks so happy. Look at him roll. Jimmy! Are you my Jimmy? Wait, long lost son? Jimmy? <laughs> Who are you? Why would I be your son? My name's Blanca. My son was lost in an airplane crash over Brazil when, pause, he was alone, well, only a little boy. Wait, that anklet. I gave that to you. What? <laughs> On your birthday? Mommy! Jimmy! <laughs> Look at him. He's so happy. And we're gonna be Abe. <laughs> Look at that happy boy. Everyone's confused by him, but Blanc is happy with everything. Give him a tiny backpack and he's good. All right, that's the end of this episode of Super Street Fighter 2 Turbo. Till the next episode, I will see you all later. Bye now.